How's it going, I beautiful people? My name is Chase the Season Dragon, and welcome back to more Brutal Warships Ship Showcase. Today, May 27th, 2021, marks the 80th anniversary of the sinking of KMS Bismarck. So I figured, hey, why not do a video on her? This is a largely secondary build, which I will show off more of after the battle in question. So for now, let's get into this. I'll make a cut and be back with you guys when I get into a battle. Alright, I've found a match. Mostly, uh, tier 6 to 8. I don't mind that very much. See so, yeah, what we got in the enemy team. Like to say, Judith Carolinas, Gneisenau, Elizabeth, Andrea Doria, Edinburgh, Flint, York, Oland, Mahan, Hatsuharu. And we have Sunzang, North Carolina, myself, Florida, Normandy, Ismail, Prince Oyen, Fiji, Miyoko, Harakaze, Mahan, and Vasterius. <laughs> Jeez, was Darius. Alright, and she is loaded, and everything's fine. Wait a minute. His name is HMS, but he's in a German ship. Blasphemer! No, oh, whatever, I don't really care. I don't know if I said this already, but this is my fourth take on recording this video. I should record these until I get a decent enough game, but I just haven't been getting that, eh? Lexington's of the enemy teams these past couple of matches. I guess it's just the day of Lexington. Which is strange to me, but eh, whatever. Don't really care. I like to pride myself as being at least half decent with the Bismarck. I mean, given the secondaries, it's incredibly, uh pigeonholed into either brawling, which is very hard to do, or just being generally less effective. But the moment I can get into what I'm meant to do, oh boy, I can do it well. This guy likes to spam the chat. Oh well. Missed. I can't shoot apparently. So that works. Darn it. Just barely missed. Andrea Doria seems to be firing at me, but I'm not overly concerned because it's tier 6 guns versus tier 8 armor. Oh jeez, our vast area has got torn in half. That's how hard I got pummeled by my secondary is decent bit. Can't see him. Hiding. I'm gonna see if I can help this Fiji and Ismail over here. If I don't go out here, then swap to armor piercing so I can really get some damage going. If my one battleship can keep uh, all this occupied, that'll help. Of course, well, I think Ismail's about to die. Sadly. Maybe he'll kill North Carolina before he does? He will. Let's make a hit nice now. Uh, I guess that's just something that happens, eh? Do you kind of 
want to see if this will work. Seems to be trying to turn away and get out of here. I don't think it particularly likes being fired at so much. Not sure what Eisenhower is doing, to be honest. I guess he's just decided to live a more honest life. Oh no, he's firing at me. Never mind. Or as I say, maybe. Damn. Yep, oh, there's York. I think we're going to start turning out as, well, Andrea Doria and Nisenau are very, trying very hard to get out of range of my secondaries. If they don't want to brawl, I'm not going to bother brawling. Another hit on him, 3k. Like, I'm an accurate salvos, but as you can see, there's just so much damage per shell. Come on. Well, that was some nice damage. Don't just be a turret, honey. Move. The fastest ship to the tier. Use it that benefits. Which at nice now speed is amazing. I'm going to talk about it on a nice now review someday. So not sure when that's coming, but hopefully soon. But that ship is really good at just kneeling around. I would like some help. Come on. Why is he firing HE at me? Hey, is he actually moving? He's actually moving. How shocking. I'm actually moving out of there. Because it ain't freaking worth it. So I'm going to keep on shooting at him because there's no reason to not. Just because right now he has HE shells, which other than the minor threat of fires, pose no real threat of actual damage. It's HE shells against Bismarck. It's even more damage. Crap. That's going to burn for a little while. Let me show you just how much I fear you, York. Turn in. That was helpful. I was just about to go in and blow him out of the water, and then he just got tapped. <laughs> uh. We're doing pretty well on at least ship's dead, but not really on score, which is something we do need to fix by pushing. So it does seem like a good idea to really start roughing up this nice now. We're just going to be lobbing HE each other for a little bit, I guess. And I'm sticking to HE because cruisers. Which seems to be very good at starting fires on me. Which bugs me.
I actually spotted something. Hello, Edinburgh. How are you? Just had to defend Gares a little bit because, hey, surprise, surprise, I'm a carrier main, primarily. Battleships are my secondaries. Which, why I play battleship secondaries? That was a good joke. <laughs> uh, my wife left me. That guy's now still alive. No, somebody shut him up. Kill the Oland. I'm within torpedo range, but also, uh... I could be able to get out of the way, thanks to hydroacoustic surge giving me a bit of an early warning system. I'm glad that flinch is not HE spamming me, so it gives you permission to do this. Torpedoes, where? Oh, there. That's the floor that's going to take them. Watch out, Florida. It's fine. Oh, it hit me. Didn't see that coming. So shooting out, ah, uh, Queen Elizabeth. I'm actually really starting to get into the thick of the battle here. Torpedoes? Ah. Ah, jeez, that unnerved me for bits. No, we should be fine. They aren't aimed at me. Still, oh boy, that was a bit of a pang of fear. So there's that Mahan dead ahead. I'm going to start to move to fire on him. And now I am fairly well running this space. Oh yeah, even though I didn't get a hit, I did get an incapacitation, which counts for something. Gotta be careful. Yep, knew there'd be torpedoes coming. Thankfully, they weren't well aimed. I guess he fired them in a rush. Ooh, there's their carrier. Got a bunch of fires on her. She put them out, I think. Yes, yeah, she did. That's all her damage control pops. There's their Mahan throwing HE at me. Going to try and get another fire. Bit of a shame, because it means I need to give up the hunt on Queen Elizabeth to move out of the way. Hey, there goes their Olens. I've been out of heals for a little while now, thanks to that little scrap. So I've just kind of been fight. So I've just kind of been fighting the good fight with some lower HP. There's that the Oland is so, or not the Oland, the Mahan, so I'm not going to push just yet. Gah! Looks like Lexington's almost done for. Just in case, I can see if I can send a quick salvo her way. Phew. Oh, sheesh. They just took out two of our ships right there. And the Lexington is still alive, just running away. She's out of my, she's out of my range now. Right, now I'm going to push back up again as I have Hydro back on. So that means I can see.
Because just that Mahan is also being pushed back. As long as we can search forward, we can eliminate them and procure a victory. Relaunching fighters. And swapping to armor piercing. I'm going to shut up this Queen Elizabeth. I think armor piercing is good for the rest of the game because the things that won't get hit too hard by it are very low HPs. So I'll still get some damage on them. What's the old Lexington Stupid of Armor is up to? I never aim far enough ahead for cruisers, man. I say as I immediately get penetration. Also, Mr. Shotgun Viking is aiming at me. Turn into port. Crap. Minor damage. We're completely fine. See, that's another way to deal with torpedo bombers. You can turn in and catch them on, like, one of your flanks before they arm. You just kind of nullify the torpedoes. Aha! Emperor is really starting to take some damage. Run scared, boys. Run scared. Because I am going to keep fighting until this ship is no more. Which may be soon because I've taken colossal damage. Come on, finish off Edinburgh. You know you want to. Probably gonna get dead into the Olin torpedoes, but for now, you're mine. <sighs> yep. I die in the shadow of glory. Hell yeah. <laughs> well, I've managed to make it so they cannot salvage a win. We take those, boys. We take those. Uh. I do always feel like I die right at the end of these recordings. So 58,000 damage. I am glad that I decided to do a couple more takes of recording because it was, in my opinion, well worth it. only two more minutes left in the match I'm going to stick around for the rest of it because I'm sure you guys do want to see kind of the ending mainly I want to see if we can actually finish off that Edinburgh I'm so glad I managed to finish off that Mahan before I got the last laugh it felt satisfying as hell <laughs> uh, screw you guys <laughs> uh, good old destroyers Yep, that was a pretty good game overall, and I got... I got 7th on the team score. That wasn't bad. A more detailed report, uh... Yeah, I dealt a lot of damage, particularly to that frickin' Queen Elizabeth. <laughs> uh, and... How much did I make? 55,000! Well, that is a very satisfying note to end this video on. This took four takes, but I am very happy with this final take. If you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, and share. Reese's Season Dragon, signing off.